Hi, I'm one of the co-founders of Base Velocity and developers of Radar Scope for the iPhone and Android OS. And uh, I joined Weather Decision Technologies and formed a new mobile team uh, with my partners from Base Velocity about three months ago. And we've been busy since then rewriting IMAP Weather Radio and redesigning it from the ground up to have it ready for storm season. And we'd like to give you a sneak peek. You can see Searcy, Arkansas has been added to my locations. And we see a red badge for number one. Uh, the red indicates that it's under a warning. One tells us how many there are for that location. So we pull up the location now in addition to forecast. You can see that they're under a flood warning. Um, we can tap on that and see some details. We'll show you on the map uh, where your pin is. We'll show you the polygon of where the flood warning is, and we'll overlay that with the current radar. Uh, you can read the text of the flood warning here, and it is a weather radio, so of course it needs to the have some audio capability. The flood warning continues for the White River at Augusta until further notice or until the warning is canned. You can also play the, video, the audio from here if you choose to, if you don't want to see that. So you can move between your uh, warnings and forecasts and things like that. Uh, the current the conditions for C. Arkin. Looking down in some of the extras, uh, we have our standard IMAP. We've completely rewritten this for the iPhone to improve performance. Uh, you can see there's a little bit of uh, precipitation off the coast of Florida today. But uh, most of the capabilities of the IMAP are improved here. We've got new overlay groups. Uh, we have improved animation and loading of the radar image. We've got a much smoother uh, zooming capability to zoom in and out. 